Dozens of people are proud to be calling themselves U.S. citizens tonight. 72 people from 35 countries took the oath of allegiance today in Aurora. As our Mackenzie O'Keefe shows us, there are always amazing stories from these events. You could see it was such a special day for so many people here in Aurora. There were tears and smiles even before the ceremony began. And that's because for many of these people, this is a day they've been waiting their entire lives for. In a packed room with hands held high, more than 70 people from 35 different countries came together to take the oath to become citizens of the United States. Every person in the room has gone through their own journey to get to where they are today. To become a citizen, they must show commitment to the principles that bind us as Americans, and in turn, they can now enjoy the rights and privileges citizens have, like the right to vote. We met Sophia Marks today, and for her, this is a lifelong dream. She fled Iraq for the safety of her family and came to America in 2012 in hopes of a better life. And today, she and dozens of others can officially call the United States home. Finally able to declare my loyalty to this country that I've loved for a very long time. And I did take the oath when I was a kid so many times by myself, and I pretended that I was in a ceremony and everything. So, you know, and um, yeah, it's just it's a great day for me. Her kids were also able to become U.S. citizens today, and now she'll become a police officer here in Aurora. Now, they tell me not only can they participate in our country's government, but this really gives them a sense of belonging right here in their community. In Aurora, I'm Mackenzie O'Keefe, covering Colorado First.